The perspective that I bring to this is that of private capital owners, family offices and family foundations who are looking to align their investments with their values and invest to create positive social and environmental impact. And um, Lori, you started us off by, I think, putting a significant, or you've got a significant challenge written into the mission of uh, Impact Entrepreneur, starting with the systems lens, uh, putting transformation front and center. And uh, John, you then talked about uh, starting with the problem and then figuring out the appropriate kinds of capital to deploy in order to give us the best chance of solving a problem. If I sort of combine all this together, if we start with the problem, recognize that most of the big problems we face in the world are complex, systemic uh, in nature. We've got to deploy a wide range of capital tools. We have to fund a wide variety of kinds of organizations uh, in order to give us the best chance of actually affecting systemic, social, or ecological outcomes that wouldn't otherwise occur. And to me, catalytic capital is about pulling that full range of tools available to us in order to create additional systemic uh, impact. What are the impacts that might not otherwise occur unless capital providers um, expand their risk tolerance, think more creatively about uh, structuring, maybe concede on terms, think more creatively about their place in the capital stack, et cetera. It's about uh, expanding the range of tools, expand, using the fullness of our creativity in order to deploy capital in the necessary ways, again, to affect additional systemic outcomes.